Dr. Carson encounters a potentially serious problem halfway through Carly's 10-hour operation. You had an, an extremely hard brain, particularly this uh, middle section of her brain was like vulcanized rubber. And uh, it was very difficult even to get the uh, bipolar uh, cutting device to go through those areas. The waiting seemed endless. Finally, 12 hours after it had begun, the good news. She was crying till we put her binky in. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna They're get her squared bleeping. away in the unit, and then as soon as uh, they have everything done, you can actually go. It'll be about a half hour, okay? okay. Thank you. She's doing great. Obviously, I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. Uh, it is absolutely our pleasure. We enjoy. When things go well, we love it. OK? All right, I'll talk to Thanks. you all later. Thanks. OK, thank you so there. much. OK. Four short months later, Carly is making great progress in her long recovery. After years of stalled development, she's beginning to walk and talk for the first time. She looks She's got pre-speech babbling. A lot of language coming. It's got about 20 or 30 words that she, you know, readily identifies. And the best was uh, walking in the house one day. I looked blue. She looked up at the sky and pointed and went, moon. We had, yeah, we had talked about the moon since the spring. It was definitely the right decision. Right, Carly? Ah. Uh, I feel she's got a uh, definite chance in life. Right, Carly? Whereas before, I don't think, uh... There's the risk that she could have stayed, too, for the rest of her life. Now she's developing at great strides.